WFNN. The Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN. Headline News Update. Good morning, everyone. On this fifth the Tuesday, the 5th of December, we're looking at the 10 o'clock Tiger Financial News Network market update. Dow down 118 at 36,066. Um, 86. You can see by this chart that it's really just a little tiny digestive moment. Uh, all the technicals so far are quite good. On balance volume did give you, give you a reversal a signal, but that's all it is. Uh, all the other technicals so far are holding well. I don't know what the news is right now. The Dow is down 163, now it's down 112. The S&P also came back from the low. It's trading down three at 45.66. It was much lower earlier. Uh, the technicals are suggesting that this is a little digestive phase. I will have to wait for the close. If at the close the S&P is down 23 points or more, it says, yeah, this should continue another couple of days at least. We're looking at the QQQ, which were very, they were very weak. Now they're up 32 cents at 386.74. Uh, within that context, uh, there being one, two, three. This is the fourth session since the high that was made at 394.14. Let's see where this goes. It needs to get to the 390 area quite quickly to be able to repair some of the little minor damage that's been seen. IWM, the Russell 2000, down a dollar twenty at 185. It's had a really nice rally. It's actually holding quite well. Gold is down. Uh, well, actually, now it's it was up, then it was down. And now it's unchanged at 2041, but it did make a lower low from yesterday. You're going to watch this very closely. This is called the Chapman Wave Inverted Roman Candle. I'll talk about that when I get back for my show, the Tiger Technicians Hour. In a moment, the, the dollar now might be a little behind, but the dollar is up 15 ticks at 103.79. And you've got crude oil. Oh, what is crude oil? Crude oil is up a dollar. It made a lower low, but it's up a dollar right now. And bonds. Bonds are up very sharply, up 1 and 21.30 seconds. So the TLT now, that's the uh, uh, iShares 20 year, has made that leg D. Um, it's at 94.04, up $1.42. So we don't really have this dark news cloud cover, which is really necessary to get a much sharper decline. So within that context, uh, we'll talk about it when we get back to say, uh, what what could bring the market down at this particular point? But in the meantime, it's holding very nicely. I'll be back in a moment for the Tiger Technicians Hour. Don't forget the Tiger.